cute starting today I don't remember the book space and uh, still in the mini cycle year topic so uh, let's uh, let's start with the the universe okay so getting started some scientists believe that the universe was created by an enormous explosion called the Big Bang over 13 billion years ago. So ever since is the universe began, it began, it has been gro growing. Scientists think that it may keep growing forever. So, and let's see, guys, you should learn about stars. Okay, there's a very inform nice information about stars. Okay. So, in stars and most best inventors, red stars are cold and blue stars are hot. That's a really like, I, I call it very interesting because mostly they use blue for cold, red for hot, right? And the solar system, mm, solar eclipse. So this is when the uh, moon comes and blocks the sun. It looks like this. It's like the moon is eating the sun. Here, the earth. This is the moon faces. New moon, it's going to be nothing in the sky. There's no moon. Crescent, there's going to be a little bit of moon, half moon, there's going to be half of it. Full moon, see it's full, half moon, yep. This end. Mercury, Venus, and Mars. So, so exploring Mars. There have been many ex missions to explore Mars. In 2004, two robots called Spirit and Up. An opportunity landed on the surface of Mars. They have sent back many of the color images of the planet. Mars also has two moons called Phoebos, which means fear, and Deimos, which means terror. So, yeah, Jupiter has a very good... Um, Jupiter is the biggest planet of our solar system. And it's like... Jupiter, if there's Jupiter, you could put 20 Earths on Jupiter. And this spot. See, there's a giant red spot. is like a storm that happened about, that existed for 300 years. Inside this could fit three of the Earths. And let's see. Okay, so Saturn, this is going to be a very good fact. If you put a swimming pool, if you find a swimming pool in the ocean big enough to fit Saturn, it would float. Saturn would float. But Saturn, there's another uh, interesting fact about Saturn. It has more than 60 moons. Uranus. So, Voyager 2 is the currently o the only spacecraft to have explored Uranus and Neptune. In 2011, you, Neptune completed its first 165-year orbit of the Sun since it was discovered in 1846. I'm going to read this wild weather. Like Earth, Neptune experienced different seasons. However, a season on Neptune can last for 40 years rather than several months. Neptune is also a very windy planet. Scientists have discovered that, like Jupiter, Neptune has its own great dark spot, which can contain fierce winds, losing at speeds of 1,500 miles or 2,400 kilometers per hour. So, space exploration, you don't need it. Sounds, no. 
topic. So I don't have anything to review more. So don't forget to check out our channel, Kenny Superstar. Bye bye.